Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when you are unable to install our creators game from Xbox app or Microsoft store on your Windows computer. Now the first step is to run gaming services repair tool. So click on your profile icon on Xbox app and then go to support option. And over here you can see gaming services repair tool. Click on gaming services repair tool and then click on start repairing. Click on yes to allow and let the repair complete. This process will take some time. And once the repair is complete, now you can install the game and then check. You can close this, install the game and then check. If that does not work, you can run gaming services repair tool from the website as well. So go to Microsoft website. So in Google, you can search Google, uh, gaming services repair tool and go to this Xbox support gaming services repair tool for the PC. Now this will take you to the official Microsoft website. Now over here, click on downloadable version and then scroll down, click on download the gaming services repair tool for PC and then run this exe file. Click on yes to allow and then let the repair complete. This will again take some time and once this is done, you will see completed option like this completed successfully. Now you can try to install the game and then check still not working. The next step is to log out and log in with correct account, same account on Xbox app and Microsoft store. So go to Xbox app, uh, go to Microsoft store at the top right. You will see a profile icon. You have to click on sign out and then you have to sign in. To the, you have to select the right account which has the game or which has the game pass and then enter your PIN or password. Now once logged in, go to Xbox app and then click on your profile icon and then click on sign out and then click on sign in and select the right account, the, select the same account which you have selected in Microsoft store which has the game pass or which has the game. So now you can try to install. Also make sure date, time, time zone and reason is correct on your computer. So at the bottom right here, you can see the date and time. Make a right click on date and time. Click on adjust date and time. And make sure set time zone automatically. If this is off, turn it on. Also set time automatically. If this is off, turn it on. And then click on sync now. Sync now is important. If you receive any error while syncing, then click on sync now multiple times. Once you see this stick over here. Now go back to time in language, language in region and make sure your country is selected over here and then relaunch the game. Next, uh, try to reinstall the game. Now the next step is to go to Microsoft store and then try to install it from a store. If you're trying to install it on Xbox app, you're facing the problem. You can go to uh, Microsoft store and then go to downloads. In downloads, if you see the game, you can try to install the game from here. You can even go to library. If you see ARC Raiders in the library, you can try to install the game from the library. You might see the game over here and then you, you can click on it and then try to install it from here. If you're trying to install it from Microsoft Store, then you can use Xbox app to install the game. Next step is to, but make sure that you log in with the right account which has the game. Next step is to delete Microsoft Store local cache folder. Now for this, you can go to this location, location open File Explorer, go to this PC, open C drive, open users folder. Now open your username folder. Now open app data. If you don't see app data at the top, click on view, select show, put a check on hidden items, open app data folder, open local folder, open packages folder, and then find Microsoft Windows Store. So scroll down. So here you can see Microsoft Windows Store underscore some alphanumeric character. Open this folder. Here you can see local cache folder. Make a right click, delete it, and then re- Try to install the game once again and then check. Still not working. Run WS reset command. So type in WS reset in Windows search box. Click on WS reset. This will reopen Microsoft store and then try to install the game. Still not working. Repair or reset Xbox app and store. So type in Xbox app in Windows search box. Make a right click on Xbox app. Go to app settings. Scroll down. Click on terminate first and then click on repair. And once the repair is done, try to install the game. You have to relaunch Xbox app and then check if that does not work. Reset, reset. And after the reset, you can open Xbox app once again and then try to install the game. Still not working. Do the same thing with Microsoft Store. So type in store in Windows search box. Make a right click app settings. And then scroll down, click on terminate and then click on repair. And once the repair is done, you can try to install the game. Still not working. You can reset, reset. And once the reset is done, you can try to install the game once again. Still not working. The next step is to update store. Now for this open Microsoft store in Windows search box, type in store and then go to downloads. And then over here, 
make sure that you log in so click on sign in and select the right account which has the game and then click on check for update and then click on update all update everything over here and then you can try to install the game next step is to install xbox identity provider now for this you can open this link in the browser it will take you to microsoft website click on view in store open microsoft store and then over here if xbox identity provider is not installed you will see install option or maybe get option or maybe update option so do it in my case it is already installed still not working uninstall gaming services to uninstall gaming services you, you can copy this command this command is provided in the video description type in powershell in windows search box and then make a right click on windows powershell make sure that you run windows powershell as an administrator only click on yes to allow paste the command over here hit the enter key this will uninstall gaming services from your computer now install gaming services so copy this second command paste it on the same window hit the enter key this will open store click on get option if you see the install button hit install and let the installation complete now once installed now you can open xbox app once again and then try to install the game still not working the next step is to start these services now for this you can type in services in windows search box and then click on services now find ip helper in the list make a double click on ip helper set this to automatic click on apply click on start if i let then click on ok make a right and then click on start or restart now find xbox services at the end here you can see four xbox services make a double click on each one of them one by one set the startup type to automatic click on apply click on start if i let it over here and then click on ok again make a double click set this to automatic and then hit apply click on start if i let it and then click on ok again automatic sorry automatic apply start if i let it and then click on ok automatic apply start click on okay now find windows update make a double click on windows update set this to automatic apply click on start if i let it then click on okay now find microsoft store install service make a double click set this to automatic click on apply click on start if i let it then click on okay now find gaming services make sure gaming services are running over here make a right click then click on if start is added click on start if restart is highlighted click on restart now the next step is to update windows now for this you can go to windows update or update and security and then click on check for update once all the updates are installed over here then restart your computer after the system restart you can check still not working the next step is to run inetcpl.cpl so type in inetcpl.cpl in windows search box and then click on it and go to advanced tab scroll down make sure you use tls 1.0 1.1 1.2 1.3 all four are checked and then hit apply apply is important click on ok and then check next step is to try installing the game to c drive or different drive now before you try this uninstall and reinstall xbox app and store so you can type in xbox app in windows search box make a right click on xbox app then click on uninstall uninstall and once the uninstall is done you, you can open store in type in store microsoft store and in the search box you can type in xbox app and then find xbox app and then you can install it from here you will see install button over here and then you can check still not working in that case if you face any trouble installing xbox app from store then in that case you can go to xbox website go to the microsoft website and over here you will see download the app option let me uninstall it first already uninstalled download the app and then run this exe file click on install over here and let the installation complete and then you can relaunch xbox app and then check if that does not work you can uninstall and reinstall microsoft store now for this you can copy this command type in powershell in windows search box and then make a right click on windows powershell and make sure that you run powershell as an administrator click on yes to allow paste the command over here hit the enter key this will uninstall microsoft store from your computer and once it is gone now copy the second command 
and then paste it on the same window hit the enter key this will reinstall store now you can launch microsoft store and xbox app and then try to check still not working the next uh, the next step is to try installing the game to c drive or different drive so you can launch xbox app now go to settings over here uh, click on your profile icon and then go to settings go to install option now over here if you are trying to install the game to c drive if you have any other drive click on this drop down option select different drive and then try to install the game if you are already trying to install the game to different drive you can select c drive and then try to install the game and then check still not working the next step is to update uh, you can use media creation tool now for this you can go to microsoft website here you can see media creation tool click on download now and then run the cxc file and then click on accept over here and then by default windows 11 will be selected click on next over here and select iso file over here and then click on next you can save it to desktop save let the download complete this process will take some time once done click on finish option and let this close automatically it will take few seconds or maybe a minute to close now go to desktop make a double click on windows iso file make a double click on setup file run this file click on yes to allow click on next click on accept and here you can see ready to install by default the option to keep personal files and app would be checked when this is checked you will not lose any data on the computer so click on install after the installation log into the computer and then try to install the game so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to install art raiders successfully on xbox app or store so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel